Cleanup gets underway today after fierce winds ripped through a southwest Florida neighborhood last night. SNN Local News 6 reporter Graham Foxleitner joins us from Venice to give a, us a look around at some of this damage. Pretty incredible, Grant. Yes, very incredible stuff here, Adrian. We're on Boxwood Drive in Sandalwood Park and take a look back there. You can see where that damage is from that carport. There was actually in the lanai behind there, though. And right now we're joined by Carl Van Gilson. Carl, that lanai ended up over here somewhere. Let's take a walk and you can see this damage over here. But Carl, when you look over here, I can't imagine how this wind was able to just deposit this 100 yards away. Well, it's, it's very strange because that's the roof off of the lanai and it picked it up and took it over that house, over another house, hit the top of a palm tree and, and it landed right here. over here. Yeah. And, and just amazing and it, and it didn't do a lot of damage, but there are other places just like this in the park. Talk about there, those. There are at least three of them where the uh, lanai or the carport or something's been totally picked up and moved a street away. So today, a day of cleanup, a lot of debris along these streets as you're yeah. driving through. We've got to do a little assessment, and I'm sure there's some insurance companies and you check things out, but uh, we'll, uh, we'll get a truck in here or something, and the, the people will all pitch in, and we'll have this cleaned up pretty quick. And the best news is that no one was injured in all of this. Some close calls, some people eating dinner, and literally this thing took off while they were inside. So some scary stuff out here in Venice, but all calm this morning. That's the latest we're reporting in Venice. Grant Boxleitner. SNN Local News 6, Adrian. Yeah, it is hard to believe no one was hurt when you see just how far that lanai traveled and ended up right behind you. And it was in the air, too. In fact, he was. there was a theory that maybe it hit a palm tree up here on the way down and then maybe that deflected it because it could have literally landed right on top of this place. All right. Well, Grant, we know you'll stay out uh, there for us today and check things out. We'll check back with you later. All right, Grant, thank you.